Hey, it's Dave Shannon from Driver Head School of Motoring. In today's video, we're looking at um, the roundabout by the Jubilee Two Leisure Centre or the Fountains Roundabout in Newcastle. Uh, coming down from Hartsill towards the Jubilee Two Leisure Centre, the first thing just to watch out for here is the Giveaway Junction. It looks like quite a straight road, but we have got the Giveaway signs either side of the road here and the Giveaway markings on the road. So the important thing is just these might possibly come to a stop, looking at to the right and also looking at that red mini just ahead of us, who is also looking to emerge into the road. In this first example, we're going to follow the road ahead, third exit at the roundabout. Now, don't be put off by third exit, it's not a right turn, it is ahead at the roundabout. It's a one way street approaching, so we've got three lanes. We'll see the road mark in just a minute. The left lane is left only, middle lane is ahead only, and the right lane goes ahead and right. So, we could use the middle or we could use the right lane. So, the standard thing to do is to use the middle lane, the right lane would be for overtaking. Now, the left lane makes a left turn at the roundabout. So that's just gonna leave the two of us, um, us and the cars to your right that enter the roundabout. So we're gonna take the outer edge of the roundabout and the cars on your right are gonna take the right closest position to the roundabout. So remember it's the third exit. So as we enter now, you can see the first exit immediate on your left. We've got quite a small exit just here now is the second and we're gonna take the third exit there on the roundabout. So this next time we're going to approach the roundabout from the same direction we've got the jubilee leisure center on your left hand side there and we're going to turn right taking the fourth exit so like we normally would for a right turn we're going to approach in the right lane and it's the fourth exit at the roundabout now the important thing here is as we come past the third exit our position needs to move to the left hand side so there's exit two exit three so you're going to do your mirrors your signal drift into that left lane and just watch the crossing on the exit the temptation is just to speed up but we've got to make sure there's no one waiting to cross there Hope that makes things clear for you. As always, you can like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. It's youtube.com slash driverheadsom to receive all these updates straight to your inbox. Um, please leave any comments if there's any videos you'd like to see and we'll do our best to help you out.